In this video, I'm going to show you how to create animated videos like this. Most of you have been looking for AI faceless niche that you can go into. This is a niche that you can actually jump on. So I'm going to show you step-by-step -step process on how to create a video like this. But before we start, let's take a look at the sample video that I curated. Chiamak, go to Mama Titi's stall and buy fresh tomatoes. Yes, Mama. How much should I buy? Use this 500 Naira and come back quickly, you hear? I won't stop, Mama. I'll be fast. What we are going to be using in this video is your mobile phone. So those of you that doesn't have laptop, you cannot start this particular faceless AI niche by creating these videos with your mobile phone. Before you start creating your video, you need to write your script. And to write your script, I've prepared this prompt for you to use. I'm going to explain this prompt for you so that you can use the same style to write any different script that you want to come up with. So from the beginning of this script, you can see here, I have create scene one. The woman sends the girl on an errand. So this is my scene one. I particularly specify what I want to get from the scene one. So here I said after scene one, give me a scene of her at the market buying tomatoes from an elderly woman. I will explain all of this to you. Then we have after scene two, give me a scene of her coming home and then she meets some of her friends on the road and starts Plane. so what we are trying to do here is to organize my story this is what you are going to do from your imagination you understand that let's say a woman sends a child on an errand where is she going to she's going to a market to buy something my scene too i said give me a scene of the child going to the market to buy something who is she buying this thing from she's buying this thing from an either an elderly man or an elderly woman or a young lady i specify that there this is how you come up with a detailed script that you can use if you watch from the beginning of this video the um, sample video I, I played you notice how that video sync where in the storytelling so I said after scene 2 give me a scene of her coming home so sh she's coming home from the errand and then she meets some of her friend on the road and then she start playing okay then after that we now have the next scene which I said scene 3 show her mother at home tired of waiting for her after the scene where she starts playing with her friend on the road the next thing should be she show her mother tired of waiting for her at home okay then after that when you come down here the next thing i now said scene four show her playing with her friends in the street then if you come down here again we now have the next thing which i said scene five her mother saw her playing and dragged her to the house scolding her so the final scene here is her mother went to the street saw the girl and then she dragged the girl scolding the girl taking the girl back to the house so that's our final scene so this is how you structure your um, video so you imagine the what you want to have from the beginning to the end when you do this it's going to give you a detailed dialogue and a detailed scene that you can use to create your video so this is how you come up with your prompt then at the ending here we now have right prompts to generate images for each character make it very bright and well contrasted in modern settings it could be a pizza style so what this prompt is going to do in um, this particular story is going to give us the character prompt so that we can have consistency in our images i've done a full video on that so you can go and watch that video i also demonstrate that in this video also then after that we now have the next um, text here which is write prompts to generate images for each scene so each of these scene each of these um, interaction there should be a prompt to generate them so this is how detailed this prompt is going to be now we are going to copy the entire prompt and then we are going to go to chat gpt here when you get to chat gpt in the text box area just paste in that entire prompt if you want to um, use this prompt i'll leave the prompt in the description below so you can get access to it so you can edit this prompt to your own taste after that we just have to send the prompt and chat gpt is going to give us a reply okay we have character image prompt consistent appearance for all scenes scene image prompt details six by nine pieces star visual bright this and that if you come down here you can see it starts from the character image prompt so here we have the prompt for the mother and then if you come down here we have the prompt for the little girl we have the prompt for the elderly woman at the market according to our prompt that we gave it now if you come down again we have another prompt for the girl's friends we are going to come down and this is the scene image prompt so for scene one the mother sends the girl on an errand so this is the prompt for that we are going to come to all of this how to use this prompt so let's scroll down and then there's no dialogue so we are going to now ask the ai again to include the dialogue for each of these scenes 
so we we'll write dialogue for each scene so we'll send it okay so now we have dialogue for each scene so now we are going to go ahead prepare our images so that we can animate these images so we are going to start from the character image prompts so for the first scene which is the model we are going to go to this website so we are going to use wix ai to generate a consistent character for our scene so that everything we are going to have will be consistent so go to this website it's showing on the screen all right i'll leave the link to this website in the video description also so that you can quickly just access that when you get to this website you need to sign in with your gmail account for you to be able to use it so when you get to this website tap on enter to and here is going to take you this is where you can start generating your images so first thing you need to do is to come down here where you see add images so just tap on that and it's going to give you this other option to add your images so for the first one here we need to add subject so this is our first subject we have two options of adding your subject you can use text or you can use um, image to add your subject we are going to use text since we have our image from for our text so now you need to tap on text when you tap on that this is where you enter in your description so there we are going to go back to um chat gpt and for the first character here which is the woman character we need to copy it select the text for the first character this is the text select the entire text for the mother and then we'll go back to this website so in the text box area just paste in what you just copied and then tap on generate so this is going to start generating the image for our first subject so this is the first um, character so what you need to do next is to add our second character and to do that tap on this plus icon you see here to add your second character and tap on this um, text box again to generate that text so we are going to come to the little girl here so we'll copy the prompt for this little girl and then we go back here again and paste in that prompt so we generate so we have that for the little girl so we are going to go back again for the elderly woman we'll do this for each of these characters so that we can have consistency in our video so for this second character so now we have all the characters ready we have the mother we have the child we have the elderly woman and if you come down here we have the girl's friend so this is our friend so we are going to now go ahead to start generating our image scene so we just close that and now we have all our images so what we do here is to go back and then we'll come down to each of these scene we'll not need to start generating images for each of the scene so we'll start from the first scene which is the woman stands the girl on an errand and then we'll come back to this place so now pay attention what we now need to do here is since this particular scene involves only the girl and the mother what we'll now do here is to tap on add images so what you will do here is to deselect deselect this woman the elderly woman and also deselect the children because we don't need them in our scene so make sure you just tap on this deselect you see i've deselected that we only have the mother and the girl child now let's paste in that our description and then we'll tap on these settings to select our aspect ratio any aspect ratio you want to use just select that for this we are going to go with the landscape aspect ratio then after that tap on send so we are going to wait while our images is being generated while this image is being generated let's go to the second scene so we'll go back to chat gpt again then for the scene 2 the girl buying tomatoes at the market we highlight that prompt that image description and we'll go back to this website okay you can see now we have the image for the first thing you can see how cool bright and detailed this image is okay it's maintaining also the cloth style everything as our character so for this let's just tap on it and download these images so that we can know the one to use okay now that that image is being downloaded we are going to come down here in this description and enter in our next scene so i pasted in that scene so this scene is showing when the girl is at the market buying um the tomato from the elderly woman so in this particular place now we need to now deselect the the um the mother's character from our scene so and to do that just come here and tap on add images when you tap on that we can deselect the mother so use this to deselect the mother and then we'll come down here and select the elderly woman we need to add the elderly woman to the image so add that now tap on this close okay see down here we now have the girl and the elderly woman so that we can generate our image now let's go ahead and tap on send 
so that we can have our image we have just gotten our image for the second scene you can see how cool and realistic this image is we can still now go ahead and download these images and decide on which one to use so after getting that scene we now we are going to create for the third scene i don't know if i should continue creating for all of this scene or you will think the video is long let generate for the third scene and then you can do the rest of the scene so to do this type on add images so this particular scene is talking about the girl and the friends on the road so we need to deselect the elderly woman because she's not needed in that scene so let's go and select the girl and her friend in on the street so select the friends and now let's close this and then we'll tap on generate why this is still generating let me explain something to you you are going to do this for all your scenes okay if you are not getting what you want you can see tap on regenerate to regenerate your videos <coughs> sorry about that so you can see tap on regenerate to regenerate your images so you can see the third scene there the girl on the street with her friend you can see the clothing style everything is the same now this is how you maintain consistency in your images using wix ai so you are going to do this for your entire scene after getting your entire scene then you can now go ahead to the next step which is to animate and add dialogue to your videos and that is what we are going to do from here to do that you are going to use this website called grog ai the spelling is going to be on the screen as most of you complain that you don't know the spelling so it's going to be on the screen right now now, i'll leave the link to it in the video description below so now let's go to grog ai you can go to your play store and download it i don't think it's available for those using iphone i haven't checked that so you can check your um app store if that if the website is available so go to grog ai and when you open up you will need to sign in using your google account after sign in you will come to this interface like this so from here you need to tap on imagine when you tap on that you can see these are Im these are videos have um, animated using this website some of you complain that the website is not free i don't know the app you downloaded but since i've been using the app it's totally free i haven't paid anything all right so let's move ahead so when you come to this website here so to start creating your video you need to come down here where you see this uh, image option so just tap on that to upload your image so this is going to allow me to upload my image immediately you upload your image it's going to start converting it to a video but don't worry allow it to convert it to a video and then we are going to add our dialogue dialogue why that is still converting to video let's go ahead to go to um, chat gpt to copy our dialogue so here we are on chat gpt and we are going to go to where we have our dialogue so let's come down here so, okay so this is where we have our dialogue so this is for the same one the woman sends the girl on an errand so we have our dialogue from here so we are going to first copy the mother talking to the girl so you need to copy this dialogue step by step because if you don't do that you are going to have um distortion in your talking in your voiceover so let's highlight that and then tap on select text so for this you are going to copy from here the mother sending the girl so let's copy that and then we'll go to this website So that's the first video being generated. There's no voiceover under that video. Now we are going to include voiceover under the video. So come down here where you see this text box area where they say type, type to customize video. Just tap on that place and now you paste in what we have just added. So if you want to have a Nigerian accent, you are going to say dialogue in Nigerian accent. So we are going to add dialogue and then we'll add this semicolon and then we'll come down here. So this is what the mother is saying. So now we'll send it. Alright, so let's take a look at this video. Chiamak, go to Mama Titi's stall and buy fresh tomatoes. You can see that that's what we are looking for. It is nice and cool. So what you will now do here, download that video as our first video. Okay, it's going to be a kind of dialogue. So what we will do here, we are not done with our first scene. So we need to come down here and go to, yes, Mama, how much should I buy? So the guest still talking. So let's copy this one. Then we'll copy to the mother. We are still going to use this same image because we are not done generating the dialogue in this particular scene so we need to come down here again and um, keep our dialogue up there the way it is and paste this use this 500 nera so we need to include nera here and come back quickly here don't stop anywhere all right so that's it so let's send this and let's see the dialogue between them yes mama how much should i buy use this 500 naira and come back quickly you hear don't all right so you can see how cool that is now let's go ahead to download this i'll show you how to combine these videos together later in this video so just pay attention all right so we'll come here and then we'll um, copy the girl where she 
say i won't stop anywhere and all that so we'll copy that we'll go back to the website again yes, in the Mama, description how much should i buy in the description again let's now add that final dialogue for the first thing so let's add this so we'll paste that in and then we'll generate that again okay so for us not to have a very long so that this video won't be very long let me now stop here so what you are going to do follow this example which i've just done and then you generate for your second scene and your third scene now after this video is done generating i'm going to now show you how to combine these videos together and then you have a full final video using cap cuts. i won't stop mama i'll be fast be careful all right we have our videos ready for our scene one so now let's go to CapCut. when you open up CapCut, tap on new project and then we are going to select all our videos that we have generated for this scene so here we have all our video let's play this video chiamak go to mama titi stall and buy fresh tomatoes all right so we have we have now a mistake there so we need to cut that off so let's cut that off so where yeah, that should go off okay so let's play again buy fresh tomatoes yes mama how much should so that's what we need to have fresh tomatoes yes mama how much should i buy use this 500 naira and come back quickly you hear don't, don't stop anyone yeah don't come back quickly you hear all right so we need to trim that off all right so let's play this again and come back quickly you hear i won't stop mama i'll be fast okay so we need to have that so that is the video so if you generate for your second scene your third scene and your fifth to your final scene you now you will now have a complete full animated video like this that you can start posting online and you get views and all that so this is how you come up with this particular style of video using just your mobile phone you don't have to pay any money at all in curating this okay so this is it if this video was valuable to you do not hesitate to like this video subscribe to this channel as that is the only thing you can do for me on this channel thank you guys for watching this video and i'll see you guys in my next video